We're with the association. Terry, why did the group break up? Just, we really hated each other, Mike. And <laughs> no, be no, sure, be no, sure. No, no, we had been on the road for seven and a half, eight years. Holy and we, uh, we were mentioned in a trivia book as having worked harder than, than uh, any group, of domestic group. Did you hit a dry spell as far as the records were concerned? Oh, it was peaks and valleys after a while, like everybody else. That's his know. business, peaks and valleys. Everybody thinks it's all up. No, we, we, we love performing. As a matter of fact, I want to go on record right here with all you people out there in the great television land. This man here gave us our first national exposure on television in 1966. Holy Toledo, back in Philadelphia. Huh? We're delighted that you guys are back because you're so musical and you're so good and you're singing live. You're not lip-syncing records or anything of that sort and it sounds wonderful. Sounds wonderful. Are you, uh, are you busy recording? And are you going for the same sound, Terry, or are you looking? Well, I, I think that we, we have the sound because it's six and seven vo say. voices singing harmony, which uh, sets us apart from uh, most other groups. But uh, there's a sound right there. That's one, of, that's one we'd like to forget, that sound. I thought that was my head. That's how long I've been in this business. <laughs> there's the boom man swinging back and forth over <laughs> No, uh, it's... Uh, it's a good sound. We're having a lot of fun. It's a wonderful sound. I can I can understand all the words. I don't know how you guys ever became a hit. When you sing, I can understand all the lyrics. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm not being facetious, uh, well, but a lot, lots of hit records you listen to. I mean, really, you listen to them and you say, what are they singing? What is that? And the kids know. The thing that worries me is the kids know. The kids know the words. We don't know the words. <laughs> we make an effort uh, to clarify what we say. I think we, we do make a conscious effort to uh, make make our lyrics understood and uh that's probably because um the music that we do sing ha have such interesting lyrics do you write your own material some of it terry 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 oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> terry wrote that's how new you have got started yeah <laughs> terry wrote cherish and uh the other uh tunes that we recorded and everything, have, that, touches and everything that touches you a six-man band and thing from uh, goodbye columbus uh one of the tunes from goodbye columbus uh -huh. that we did well, I'm going to get out of here because I want, to, I want you to sing another song, and so do they. The Association. Thank you, Mark. One, two, three, four.
listening to the radio. Oh, yeah. The association. Coming right back with Judy Norton Taylor, award winning commercials right after this lesson. Thank you, guys. Wonderful. You know, Terry, a moment ago when you said, uh, you know, you've been apart, you guys, for eight years, and you said you said seven and a half years on the road, my first thought was, how do you keep families together, family life going all the time? Well, or you go for the average. <laughs> <laughs> no, no it, it is difficult. It, it puts a, a stress on uh, most relationships. Any uh, broken marriages uh, in that seven years? Seven? Uh, 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 seven? No. Good. No. Not quite, but Only six. <laughs> I want everybody in this group to uh, make themselves known out there. Uh, tell who you are and where you're from at all. I'm Jerry Kirkman. I was, I was raised here in California, born in Kansas. But raised here in the Los Angeles area, Terry? Chino. Chino. Oh. Chino. Chino. Right. And you are? I'm Larry Ramos. I was born in Hawaii, on the, the little island of Kauai. And uh, I was raised here also. You said Kauai, and Don Ho told me it's pronounced cow eye. That's the way Don pronounces it. <laughs> You're saying he wasn't sober at the time when he gave it. Uh, he's not from Kauai. Southern Kauai. He's, uh, he's, uh, he's from Hilo. Right? He's, uh, I believe he's from Honolulu. <laughs> That's why. Nice to have you here. You are Jim Yester, and uh, born in Alabama, but I grew up in Burbank. Burbank. That's Burbank. where my first little GI house was in Burbank. Where'd you grow up in Burbank? Well, just about a half a block from uh, Walt Disney there. I wasn't far. I was on Brighton Street in Burbank. When you, you're Russ. I was uh, born in New Hampshire. What's Reed? your last name, Russ? Jaguar. Russ. <laughs> Russ Jaguar. Russ Jaguar. Yeah, I was uh, born in New Hampshire, raised in San Diego, and uh, lived in L.A. By the way, Russ, San Diego. By the way, we'll no, be that's from Chino. That group. No, uh, <laughs> we'll be in San Diego on the 29th of uh, November with the Beach Boys. As a matter. Oh my gosh. They'll be there. <laughs> and you are? Jules Alexander. I'm from Chattanooga, Tennessee. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes. You got a little bit of that Tennessee sound in the group here, see? A lot of it. And you are? I'm Rick Olsky. I'm, I was raised in Seattle, Washington. Moved down here to Los Angeles. Oh, what a... What a he, he's the bass singer. He's the bass singer in the group there. It's Rick. Or either that or he was up late last night. <laughs> and you are? My name is Ted Blueshell, and I was born in San Pedro. And I still live in California. Good for you. A lot of Californians in this group. Well, you're going to do one of your biggest hits. Now, you have a story about this. Yeah, it's kind of, kind of a funny trip because it's a very wordy song, uh, Along Comes Mary. And uh, I sing the lead on it. And, uh, you know, when you do a song for a long time, you just assume that everybody knows the song from, from both sides, whether you're a background singer or a lead singer. And uh, just before going on a tour one time, I was in a motorcycle accident and wound up in a hospital, and I didn't go on tour. And on the plane, everybody was trying to figure out, well, who covers this part, who covers that part? And, and Jewel says, well, he's one of the other tenors. He said, well, I'll take uh, the lead for Long Comes Mary. And I said, okay. And they moved on to other songs. And uh, they got well, about an hour before... D uh, getting ready to do the show, they stopped and thought, well, do you really know the lyrics? And nobody really knew the lyrics. They had to call me in the hospital. <laughs> you were doing ooh in the background. Sure. Wow. Well, sing it for us now, and you better know the lyrics, guys, because there are no cue cards out there. The Association. One, two.
got all the words right, too. I sang along with it. The associates will be right back with a big prize for someone in our studio audience. Right after this. Great right enjoy that, folks. And the association for another seven and a half years. The moment is at hand. Finalists, I've asked Jim yesterday, the association, to pick the winning card. There are three of them. Just shuffle them and pick one, and then open it up, and I will announce it, okay? He's not even looking. Okay, here's... Oh, he gave me two. He gave me two. No, no, quickly, quickly. Don't, don't tear it, for heaven's sakes. Okay, here we go. It is open, and, and the winner is... Christy Whitesell. Come on, Christy. Thank you.